the pursuit of moral purity and ideal justice slips into violence. This is exactly what happened in the Soviet Union. The original communist revolutionaries were so clear and bright-eyed on the utopia that they wanted to build. But between Lenin and Stalin, there were an estimated one million political executions. Both Lenin and Stalin believed they were creating a new purified world, an egalitarian utopia free from exploitation. The Soviet experiment began with a dream of equality and ended in terror. In the thousands of cases like these, utopian zeal plus human psychology, fear and rivalry and paranoia and tribalism, this combination produces the opposite of paradise. Whenever movements aim to purify human nature itself, they eventually turn the blade inward. And this is where psychology and neuroscience become key parts of the analysis. Because at the center of every grand political blueprint sits the human brain. A brain that evolved in survival conditions tuned for tribalism, for hierarchy, for rivalry. 